What's up everybody, it's Neil here with Nexus 7 Soft Modder. Today I'll be showing you how to get Flash Player working on your Nexus running Android 4.4 and above. Because with the KitKat update, it's basically made it so that Flash Player and Flash videos aren't working with the Chrome browser, Firefox, and any other browser it seems like. But, thanks to a developer named Survivaland, he has hacked a um, Flash Player file that we will we will install and easily get those videos running so there's a few things you want to do first this actually still doesn't work for uh, Firefox if you have it or Chrome it only works for Dolphin browser so you're gonna need to install Dolphin browser I already got it on here so let's check it out and there's a few things you want to do you want to go to the settings and go to the uh, make sure that Dolphin jetpack is checked on and uh, this is actually included in the uh, latest version of Dolphin Browser. If you have an older version, update. Because before you would have to uh, install Jetpack separately. And essentially it just speeds up the browser. Okay, before installing the hacked um, Flash Player file, make sure you don't have one already on your device. So just in go ahead and uninstall any pre-existing ones. I don't have any, so it's not a problem. Then download the hacked file. All of these things will be provided in the article on Nexus 7 Softmodder. So you're just going to install. And after installing, there's no need to open. Just hit done. Then we're going to do one more thing. We're going to go into Dolphin Browser again. Go to the settings. Now go to Web Content. And make sure that Flash Player is always on. So, I'm sure you want to see that it works. Let's go to, uh, here we go, Flash Player Test. You want to click this little link right here. And if you see this bouncing box animation, like that, then you got it. Now just to show you the difference, let's go to, oh, let's go to Flash Player Test here. And this one will actually give you a little notification saying that you need to install a plugin. So there you go, this is what you get if you don't have that. So uh, check it out, it's uh, super easy as you can see. Check out the full article, it's completely detailed and mapped out for you to follow. Um, it's on Nexus 7 Softmodder. Like, comment, subscribe, and thanks for watching guys.